Here's how to use arbitrary Python files in Databricks instead of using a percent %run command. So if you use the percent %run command, what you're doing, and let me just show you, we have two folders here, code and test utils. And so inside code, I have the standard notebook, and test utils has a notebook called math utils, right? So I call percent %run, and I use a relative path to test utils and math utils. And in there, there's a function defined called multiply numbers, which just takes two arguments and multiplies them. If we hand that back, what we do is we just call the multiply numbers function with two arguments and we run and you can see it all happens really easily but you know percent run is kind of kind of weird it's kind of, kind of like polluting the global address space uh, you'd be better off using arbitrary python files which is very similar to creating like a python package right and the code for that is something like this so I, what i can do is comment this out real quick so we import sys, and the reason why we do that is because we need the relative path, so we append the relative path here. And then we import the folder, remember we have this folder here called test utils, as a, kind of like a package, and then we use math utils, which is the um, which is a Python file. Instead of using a notebook, we use a .py file, and we import it as math, and then what we have to do here is call the function math. So that's pretty great, so when we run all, and it just runs. So if we look back at MathUtils, you can see that we have MathUtils.py, uh, and that is just a file now, not a notebook. And it defines that function, and it runs just great. So um, that allows better code separation and is easier to use GitHub if you have to use source control. I think it's much easier to run these things out of GitHub like that. And I think it's very, uh, very cool feature that was just released a few months ago, and hopefully you enjoy it. Thanks, hopefully that helps you out.